ഹലോ വണ്ടർഫുൾ ഗുഡ് മോർണിംഗ് ടു ഓൾ മൈ സെൽഫ് രാഹുൽ ഐ ആർ അസിസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് പ്രൊഫസർ ഇൻ ഡിപ്പാർട്ട്മെൻറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഇലക്ട്രോണിക്സ് ആൻഡ് കമ്മ്യൂണിക്കേഷൻ എൻജിനീയറിംഗ് ഓഫ് വേദവ്യാസ ഇൻസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂട്ട് ഓഫ് ടെക്നോളജി ഐ വെൽക്കം യു ആൾ ടു ദി ടെക് ടോക് സെഷൻ ഓൺ സൈലൻറ്റ് സൗണ്ട് ടെക്നോളജി വാട്ട് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് എ ടെക്നോളജി ദാറ്റ് ഹെൽപ്സ് യു ടു ട്രാൻസ്മിറ്റ് ഇൻഫർമേഷൻ without using your vocal cords this technology aims to notice lip movements and transform them into a computer generated sound that can be transmitted over a phone hence person on other end of the phone receives the information in audio now the need of silent sound technology an end to embrace the situations such as a person answering his silent but vibrating cell phone in a meeting lecture or performance and whispering loudly i can't talk to you right now in the case of an urgent call apologetically rushing out of the room in order to answer or call the person back now the origination of this technology the idea of interpreting silent speech electronically or with a computer was popularized in the 1968 stanley kubrick science fiction film 2001 a space odyssey in 2010 at sebit one of the largest trade fair a new concept called silent sound technology was demonstrated this technology is being developed by scientists of karlsruhe institute of technology germany now let us go to the basics that is how we speak when we generally speak aloud air passes through larynx and the tongue words are produced using articulator muscle in the mouth and jaw region recently it is proved that when we are about to speak due to reflex action of muscles the articulator muscle becomes active irrespective of whether air is passed through them or not even by saying words without producing sound weak electric currents are sent from brain to speech muscles this phenomenon is called electromyographs now for the silent sound technology two methods are used the first one is is the electromyography which is the process of monitoring tiny muscular movements that occur when we speak signals are converted into electrical pulses that can then be turned into speech without a sound uttered the second method is the image processing image processing is the process of converting digital data tap into a film image with the minimal corrections and calibrations large mainframe computers employed for sophisticated interactive manipulation of the data now let us move deeply into electromyography it is a technique which monitors tiny muscular movements and pulses generated by it the transducers involved converts the pulses into electric signals electromyographic sensors attached to the face records the electric signals produced by the facial muscles compare them with the pre-recorded signal pattern of spoken words now the working of electromyography a needle containing two 
fine wired electrodes is inserted through the skin into the muscle tissue then the electrical activity when the muscle is at rest is observed each electrode track gives only a very local picture of the activity of the whole muscle because skeletal muscles differ in the inner structure the electrode has to be placed at various locations to obtain an accurate signal thus by this way the speech can be communicated without sound this is the flow chart of the processes the first step is hmm based visual phonetic decoding hmm means the hidden markov model and then audio visual unit selection and next concatenation of the selected units acoustic components and finally hnm based prosodic adaptation hnm means harmonic plus noise model now the second method image processing the simplest form of digital image processing converts the digital data type into a film image with the minimal corrections and calibrations then large mainframe computers are employed for sophisticated interactive manipulation of the data in the present context overhead prospective are employed to analyze the picture image processing can be classified into two analog image processing and digital image processing in analog image processing it is applied to hard copy data such as photographs or printouts it adopts certain elements of interpretation such as primary element spatial arrangement etc with the combination of multi concept of examining remotely sensed data in multi spectral multi temporal multi scales and in conjunction with multi disciplinary allows us to make a verdict not only as to what an object is but also its importance apart from this it also includes optical photogrammetric technique allowing for precise measurement of the height width location etc of an object in digital image processing it involves a collection of techniques for the manipulation of digital images by computers it contains some flaws to overcome the flaws and deficiencies in order to get the originality of the data it needs to undergo several steps of processing digital image processing undergoes three general steps pre processing display and enhancement and finally information extraction now let us discuss the features of silent sound technology the native speakers can silently utter a sentence in their language and the receivers can hear the translated sentence in their language it appears as if the native speaker produced the speech in a foreign language the translation technology works for languages like english french and german except chinese where different tones can hold many different meanings and this allow people to make silent calls without bothering others now the applications of silent sound technology it helping people who have lost their voice due to illness or accident telling a trusted friend your pin number over the phone without anyone if dropping assuming no lip readers are around silent sound technique is applied in military for communicating secret or confidential matters to others now coming to the conclusion silent sound technology one of the recent trends in the field of information technology implements talking without
stocking. It will be one of the innovative and useful technology and in the near future this technology will be of use in day-to-day -day life. Thank you.